All right there, basketball fans. Well, good news and bad news. Good news for the Miami Heat. Dwayne Wade will play on Friday against the Boston Celtics. The bad news for the Celtics, the fact that he's playing, and, well, they're gonna, not going to have, obviously, since my uh, video earlier, they're not going to have Paul Pierce or Kevin, Kevin Garnett. So what does this mean? Well, pretty much, this is me giving you my early prediction on the Heat game. <clears throat> for tomorrow, I don't think the Celtics are gonna have a chance. I think they'll lose the game pretty easily. I mean, they really don't have. I mean, I don't know. Celtics bench, can they compete with the Heat? You know, not with the Heat's bench, but with the Heat. You know, the you know, entire team. Still don't know if LeBron Bosh gonna play, but Wade is coming back. You know, probably to get warmed up for the playoffs. You know, you don't want to go under all rusty. You don't want to go under like, you know, like you haven't played a game in a while, and you know you have to like. You know, get it together, and you know we don't want that now. We don't want an Indiana Pacers situation or a Celtic situation with a Chris Bosh, where he literally not know what was going on <clears throat> in the first couple games, even though he played pretty well. Besides that, it's good. You know, good to see Wade back. You know, he's a good player. You know, the first of the big three to be in Miami. You know, could he drafted him, everything like that. And well, it's gonna be good stuff. So be good stuff seeing Wade play the game again. Anyways, guys, just a short video. I want to give you my opinions on it. Well, guys, yeah, give a like, subscribe, leave a comment, tell me what you think, and then tell me if you're a Heat fan or a Celtics fan. I'm a Heat fan. I don't really care what fan you are, but it's all good. Any love, it doesn't matter. Anyways, guys, I am out. Peace. Mm.